Hey, five stars here. This is for uh, NYC and his new purchase of his new guitar. Now, you got a good model. Uh, as a matter of fact, I'm going to show you something here. I have a Les Paul. It's similar to yours. You can see mine's a silver burst. Black. Got the witch hat. Witch hat tuners. Trapezoid. Fret markers. And as you can see, also it's a, a Gibson Les Paul Studio model. Very nice, uh, very nice guitar. I've had mine now for about oh about a month. Uh, it has great sound. It's beautiful. The neck is perfectly straight. Now, one thing I would suggest you do, and since you own probably tons of guitars, you probably know this already. What I had to do with mine to get a bluesier sound, I would suggest if you want bluesier sounds on a Les Paul guitar, put on some Ernie Ball tin strings. 10 strings, Ernie Balls, 10s. That'll give you a nice bluesier sound. So change the strings that came originally with the guitar. If you want a more rock and roll sound, you could probably put eights, Les Paul eights, or maybe even some Diodarios or something like that on it. If you do change the strings, make sure, and you probably know this already, about making sure to check the intonation at the 12th fret harmonic harmonic at the 12th fret with a guitar tuner tune the guitar first harmonic it at the 12th fret if it's off a little bit on each string if it's flat it's got to go forward if it's sharp it's got to go backwards and you can do that with little you can see the little screws right here in the back of where you set the intonation once you get the intonation set the guitar is going to stay in tune for a long, long time. Well, at least 40 hours of strings, you know, change of strings, at least 40 hours of playing time. One of the things about this Les Paul guitar, these uh, uh, studio models, they're lighter than uh, some of the more expensive Les Pauls because they don't have the perfilling that uh, go all the way around the the body, the purfling, some of the uh, other uh, ornate features that make some of the other older Les Pauls a lot heavier than what these studio models are. Now they they're very great guitars. You got a good buy there, NYC. Practice, play, and even if you don't feel like it someday pick it up look at it admire it and at least do 15 minutes of scale exercises or something like that but uh hey congratulations you got a nice guitar there go cowboys peace